Today's video is sponsored by KiwiCo. Hey Greens, and welcome to opening 240 viral TikTok mystery bags. These mystery bags are more specifically for dollhouse miniatures. If you're not familiar with dollhouse miniatures, it's basically decoration and furniture for your own dollhouses. They can be anything from little plates, vases, slippers, all the way to carpets if you really wanted to. And of course they would have miniature foods. And so on my quest to find the perfect mystery boxes from TikTok, I have been... Hence why I bought 240 of them from eight different brands this time. If you're curious to see the first 120 and the first half of those brands, feel free to click on the video that looks like this. I will also link it down below, and you can go ahead and watch it after this one. But just a quick little recap. <clears throat> We got a huge variety of interesting mini bottles that were in fact to scale for the most part except for that coca-cola can I don't know where that came from and we still haven't succeeded in getting a miniature food Mystery bag all of them including all the previous ones that I've done which is close to like 500 at this point have been absolute scams. They've broken a heart. They've made me breathe fire they even made Salty Crafter come out of the forests to check this out. Because they were basically cabochons. And cabochons are flat back decorations that you can use to do decoden in terms of phone decorations or other type of decorations mostly. Because they're kind of, they're not realistic speaking. Let me know in the comment section below if you think the next four different brands are going to be different or similar. I really want this to be... <laughs> For those of you who are new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe. We do all sorts of weird things that make me cry, and I do wave sharp pointy things at you. You will learn to love it. Click on all notifications while you're there. So similarly to the previous one, we're going to divide them into sections, and the only way I know how to divide them is because of the serial code. Here starts with ZH, so we have 30 of those. 7B, also 30. 4A, 30. 8J, 30. So we do have 120. that these were in different categories, the baggies look exactly the same. I kid you grains not, these are different brands. You saw the serial code, but they're the same baggies. So let's put you aside. There. And this is going to basically set the tone for the rest of the video. I think this is going to be food, but... No! <laughs> oh no! So we're starting off with a flat back cabochon again. And as cute as this is, this is not to scale. The actual posting itself, as you can see here, says 1 12th scale, which is for miniatures and dollhouses and for toy photography. So a flat back is not exactly a prop for a figurine to hold and... Hello darkness, my old friend. It's not a good start, but it means that we have 30 to discover of this right now. Oh no, they are mocking me. It says, I love you. We have another flat back. I guess this is supposed to be a popsicle, but if we remove the bottom part, it's a toast. Don't tell me this is not. 100%, they recycled the mold. This is a toast. And a kind of cake with cherry. Oh my god, this is gonna be one of those videos, isn't it? What? Is that the same one? No, they might as well be. They just might as well be at this point. <laughs> what are you? Okay, I'm not sure exactly what's going on here, but I can live with this. This can definitely be reworked for a 1 12th scale type. And you are, an we are getting a lot of cakes here. Or is this a cookie of some genre of cookie? Can't tell. Definitely can't tell. This, we can work with it. Not great. Not exactly what we're looking for, but it's manageable. Oh no, we have the french fries. In the previous video, we got this exact same french fry, but blue. And I also wanted to say thank you to many of you in the comment section who informed me very nicely that specifically a blue waffle is. I'm always educated 
thanks to you. We are getting so many cakes, holy carp. What is that? This is the exact same mold, but a different color. Now this is just an insult because the posting did say no repeats. They're like, it's a different color, it's not a repeat. Okay, technicalities, I'll live with that. <laughs> and we have a donut flat back, all of them. You are a another cake. I have to say, I am not liking these cakes. Is this the same thing? No. They're all just different, but cakes. I mean, food isn't just cake, is it? Is it? So we're starting off with our first 10 not so good. <laughs> we have so many. And don't be fooled by the back where you see a bottle and then here we have food. I know the bottle is very obvious. You're like, oh, this should be the bottle category. No, it's either or. Either foods or bottles. So let us discover a strawberry. Definitely not to scale. This is probably bigger than some of my figurines heads, just to be clear. I love how you grains enjoy seeing me do the What the heck is this? Okay, so it's another, I think these are blue pancakes. And please do not tell me that blue pancakes insinuates anything. I don't know anymore. So about that, <laughs> apparently it does mean something else. I don't even know what to do anymore at this point. You are love. They're really obsessed with cakes, aren't they? I guess while we're trying to discover if these are cakes and donuts and whatnots, what are your favorite non-sweet foods? I'm very curious, let me know in the comment section below. Here is a huge donut. And for scale, here are one of my characters. This is not to scale donut. I'm pretty sure it's okay if we had a donut that looked like that, but it's a novelty size, not real time size. What? <laughs> What are you? Some kind of heart, because hearts are food. I like how I ordered the food categories of every brand and the bottle categories, and yet we get things like hearts and slippers for some weird reason. And an oversized pink chocolate. I really hope at least the other two brands will be something to scale. <sighs> yeah, these are cheap. If you do see this posting and these ads, do not pick them up. Some kind of heart lollipop. And another happy birthday cake, which is the exact same one that we got in the previous 10. And another candy. They are cute, like don't get me wrong, these are cute. But the issue that I have is that they are making promises for dollhouse miniatures. And that's not what we're getting. So it's the false promises for me. All right, so this is the last 10 of this brand when it comes to foods. And it's, I was about to say, is that a pizza slice? But no, a watermelon popsicle. Oh no, I already see that this is flat. At this point, my hope went from here all the way to the bottom. That's what happened with my hope, at least for this one. Hopefully the next ones are better. This is a different one. Giant strawberry in a cake thing. A what? Is that Peppa Pig? <laughs> a Peppa Pig! I did not expect to see you here, Peppa Pig. Hi there, nerdy crafter. So what do you think about these uh, mystery bags? <laughs> <laughs> so it looks like Peppa Pig is definitely in on this. That's just weird. <laughs> you, another happy birthday cake. This one is different, because that one's pink. We're gonna give you something different. It's not gonna be repeats, but it's not gonna be what we also promised you. Another I love you toast popsicle. Oh my god, this is hard. Okay, a little star type cookie. Oh, what's that? With a factory default. Defect. Oh, that's a big one. What is that? What the heck? Okay. <laughs> what? <laughs> This is the first time that we get something that looks like an actual dish for a miniature. So this can be like a bigger hot pot. This is good. This, this is good. It's obviously technically bigger than 1 12th scale, but it can be used as a like a communal pot of food thing. Oh my god, look at that. Whoa, we got a beacon of light, of a uh, beacon of hope? A beacon of hope, light, light, light of hope. Okay, this is good. This is good, we get glimpses of hope. Glimpses of hope is what I was looking for. Okay. <laughs> We're getting glimpses of hope here and there, but then they just do this to us. Back to the ice cream. 
another undefined cookie cake. Some of them are great. Some of them are just like, what are you even doing? Wait, did we just get two of the same thing? I think we got repeats. I don't remember if it was in this batch. I'll have to rewatch this. <laughs> okay, and... Oh, oh. I'm not sure why this is flat, but this is definitely a bit of hope. So we have a kind of dango dessert, which is very popular in Japan. So I've been corrected by my editor that this is in fact Chinese hawthorn, not Japanese dango. Whoops. So I'm guessing it can be flat so you can put it on some kind of plate, but again, it is slightly on the big side, not to scale. And so our first 30 yielded a pink mess of a headache and Peppa Pig. Enough of that. And the only things that really look like food decorations for a dollhouse, there we are. Now the next 30 of the different brand, this one is supposed to be drinks. So bottles in theory. And already these feel much better because I can feel a 3D kind of shape. Are they drinks? That's a whole other story. <laughs> and, oh, 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 we have one just labeled beer. So obviously some of these might be repeats, even though technically they shouldn't because they're different brands than the one I had in the other video. So I guess we will find out. Ooh, this is a new one. We have XO. This is a really cute bottle. Holy carp, I'm in love. These bottles are so far so good. You are cute. All right, so this is similar to one we got last time. Oh, this one's a big one. What are you? Ooh. We have Jack Daniels. No, that is awesome. Let me move the pelt. There you go. So this is pretty cool again for a background. Do not disappoint. Oh, yes. We have 1664 blue bottle. Oh, a yellow one. What are you? Oh, teacher choice beverage during parties. 100%. I don't want to hear that name ever again, though. Water bottle. In the previous video, I had no idea what Volvic was. And so many of you in the comments let me know that this is a very popular water bottle brand in Europe for the most part. So that is always fun to find out. What is that? Oh, the soda water. Again, these are pretty good. They're very close to scale. Some of them, not so much. Like this one is slightly on the bigger side, but we can handle that. At least they're 360. They're a full rounded figure. Kind of like me. <laughs> I am full rounded, full bodied. Speaking of full bodied, this is my full bodied kitten, Ramses. And I love every inch of him. Mwah. Oh, this is new. We have Wusu, and I'm not familiar with what this is. For those of you who know, again, always leave the timestamps or feel free to describe it and let me know exactly what it is. I love learning about new things from around the world. And is that a chia seed? Yes. A chia seed drink. I like the fact that we can see the tiny little seeds on the inside. This is fun. See, there's a reason why I do the foods because they break my heart and then the drinks which have a little bit more hope. So if you're looking for drinks, get them. We need to balance those emotions. <laughs> Oh, another blue one? This one is Harbin Ice. I don't think I've ever had this one before, but Harbin definitely rings a bell. I've just never had it. Oh, I like that this one kind of looks vintage and we can see tiny specks of something on the inside. I have no idea what this is though. It's way too blurry to tell, but this is really cute. Look at me, I'm Sweetie Crafter right now. This is definitely, oh! What? Banana milk. We have Snoopy. I like how all these known characters are making random appearances. We had Peppa Pig and now we have Snoopy. I feel like this one is more of a Rement, which is a popular Japanese brand of miniatures, but I still feel like this is kind of big, but cute nonetheless. I guess it could be a North American extra large drink. This one's really big too. Milk. We got a milk carton like last time. I don't know why, they seem to be getting bigger and bigger. What is going on here? Oh yes, this is a really fun bottle shape. I love this a lot. Oh, another one. Kingway. I swear, so many of these brands I've never heard of. Mind you, I don't really party that often. <laughs> And at least the good thing about these bottles is that if you're not familiar with the brand, you can definitely remove the tag and make them your own. Oh yes, 
So are you kidding me is not an actual drink as far as I can tell and nobody as far as I could have seen corrected me in the comments But if I'm wrong, please let me know I don't know why it's called are you kidding me, but it is a cute little bottle that you can turn into a water bottle We have a height. I don't know if it's height or haita or wherever it's from You are just pink <laughs> Just a pink bottle here. It is against the blue background. You can tell this one's pretty tiny. Oh, a Hennessy. Interesting. The label is extremely blurry, so I can try and bring it as close as possible. You still won't see nothing. But wait, before we go on, let's talk about today's sponsor, KiwiCo. For those of you who don't know KiwiCo, it is a monthly subscription box that allows little ones to see themselves as engineers and problem solvers. They are of the mindset, small today, big tomorrow. These kits are designed to help little ones be exposed to concepts in Steam and for creatives like you and I to try out new things. They have nine different lines of subscription, everything from Panda Crate, all the way to Maker and Eureka, each line catering to different age groups. And the fantastic thing about KiwiCo boxes is that you do not need to go and pick up anything from boxes. They truly do include everything you need, from popsicle sticks to little cuppies, truly everything. The instructions are so simple, even I can follow them. And the educational magazines that come in there even make me so excited to just read them and learn so much information. You know what, let's get a project going. Crystal Ombre Soap Making. So if you're looking for the perfect gift for the curious learner in your life, and yes, the holidays are around the corner, be sure to go to kiwico.com forward slash nerdy crafter to get 50%, yes, 50% off your first month of any crate. Yes, you see all these options? Any of these can be yours at 50% off. Thank you KiwiCo for sponsoring today's video and being huge supporters of this channel. This is a really good set of mini bottles. I am really happy with them. So this one, this barcode here, definitely a must. So far, all the ones that are bottles have not disappointed us. If any of you know of any mystery boxes or mystery bags that have real dollhouse miniature furnitures or props or anything like that, let me know and I will try them. So far, all of these are from AliExpress, which is basically kind of like Wish, so they've broken our hearts. So these next ones should also be bottles because it is the same set. Oh, no, we have another Snoopy. What were the chances of that? I guess pretty high. Because in the previous set, we didn't get any kind of Snoopy. So this is interesting. Different brands will give us different things, but some things are similar. We have another milk. Oh, so many of you were correcting me because we got a yellow one in the previous unboxing and you're letting me know that that was a banana milk. So I'm guessing this is a strawberry milk. Something about Jung Soo, I'm not sure. Another Volvic, yes. So another water bottle. Another 1664. I really love these bottles so much. Even the detail on the caps are absolutely phenomenal. Why am I struggling with this one? Oh, there it is. Is that the same one? No. Oh, but we get another Harbin. Interesting. So the same one that gave us the blue bottle in the previous 10 also gave us the Harbin one. This is a different one. So this here is a rum that I still have yet to try. And this is another Jack Daniels. It's so funny because we just didn't get any Jack Daniels last time. We got Red Label. You are, what the heck? So I have no idea what this is. <laughs> I'm genuinely not sure what this is. It is a nice bottle though. This is a little one. Oh, I spoke too soon. We have now the red label that I said we didn't get this time, but here it is. So we got both the Jack Daniels right here and the red label. Known brands I can do, well, known brands that I know because I'm pretty sure in other countries, the other brands are no, but I'm happy with those. And now we have the brand that starts with 8J. And this one again should be miniature foods. So are they gonna be cabochons? I don't know, although patterns tell me that yes. And this is going to set the mood, it feels flat. We are getting a crumbly star. Best wishes. It's telling us good luck, basically, which means we might as well set ourselves up for failure. <laughs> and another popsicle with seeds. Not sure exactly what they were going for. I know that seeds 
are there to grow things. And right now I am growing with resentment. <clears throat> Three layered popsicle? What the shrimp? What is that? That is one of the weirdest <laughs> concepts ever. <laughs> oh, at least not everything is pink. But we do get another best wishes though. It really be do, do being insulting us at this point. I love you popsicle toast thing. I don't love you though, just saying. A yellow watermelon popsicle. And for those of you who are like, but popsicle isn't yellow, Jaggy. What are you talking about? Actually, interestingly enough, yes, there is yellow fleshed watermelon. Did I say popsicle before? I meant watermelon. So you have your pink watermelon and you have your yellow watermelon. Okay. You saw nothing! Okay. Oh, there it is. It's right under me. I can get that. We have a pink cactus that is definitely very weird looking. Definitely, absolutely weird looking. And it says sunny on it. It would have been great if it were a 360 item because then we can use it as decoration as intended. But nope. You will not have a miniature cactus. And we have a weird avocado. Okay. I think this is the first character food. The Peppa Pig one was Peppa Pig on a food, but this is a food character. A corn. Oh, why am I dropping everything? We have a flat back corn. Again, way too big for scale. Another candy. We already got something like this. A soft serve. Okay. Oh no, that weird eight cookie thing. I don't know if it's a mooncake. I can't tell. I can't tell. What? Oh, a honeydew? Honeydew melon? Why is it pink on the inside? Why is the inside stuck on the outside? So many questions. A lollipop? Like, there's not even an effort to make the stick a different color from the actual lolly, so... Again. Another one of these ambiguous desserts with love. Here is that three-layered popsicle thing. I don't get it. What are you? Is that a strawberry on a podium? What the heck is this? It's almost like these kits are designed to confuse you. First of all, it's not what it's advertised to be. Secondly, you get things like this. Or is it a strawberry wearing a hat? I don't see it. If you see it, let me know. I don't know what that strawberry is doing. Oh, another donut with sprinkles, maybe. Whoa, we just got the exact same thing again. So not only does the post say no doubles, but we totally got doubles. It's just getting worse and worse and worse. Oh, well, these are just popping right out. We have the cherry that lets you know that it is in fact a cherry by having it written right there. And we have a unicorn popsicle. We got two other colors in the previous ones, the previous different brands. And this is another love cake. Should just have hate written on top of it. Oh, we still have another 10 of the foods before we go on to the drinks. Another one. So this is another of the unicorn exactly same color, but at least it's not in the same set of 10, which means not a double. Same candy. Oh, a character popsicle. Same as we had with the avocado. Cute, again, not a house decoration. Another corn, because this is a very corny set. Uh, ambiguous cake. And a flat. What the heck? How is this food again? We got this teddy bear in the previous set. And again, this is just a flat teddy bear. Last I checked, the plushies that I have are not flat. They have character. They're well-rounded. Oh, what? Okay, so this brand definitely gives you doubles and duplicates. We just got two of the exact same character popsicle. This is not looking good for this set. Not one bit. I think this is probably the worst set out of all the other ones that we saw so far. Honestly, Grains, this is garbage. Again, those donuts, they seem to love that. And the last in this one before we head on to the bottles. And this is a cake pop heart cookie thing. Now I'm pretty excited about these ones because unlike the other ones that were different and the barcodes were different, they look the same. 
But these ones actually do look different. Look at that. So these are the previous ones that we've been opening. And this one, even though it says the exact same thing, which I think you grains told me means surprise, they look different. So hopefully we get a new inventory of stuff. Please be cute bottles, please. And I feel like all these different brands are just recycling the same thing at this point. Give us something different. Oh, we have chia seeds again, but this time I think it is peach. We had peach before in another bag. I don't remember which set. Kingway again. So if they're the same, I'm just gonna show you if they're different. I'm just gonna say this is new or something like that. Cause oh my God, come on. Yeah, I'm not familiar with this one either. There's so many repeats despite being different ones. Why? Why would they sell them as separate brands if they're the exact same thing? Another EXO. I love this bottle, so I'm not too angry about this. You are another Hite or Height. A triple of this one. Oh, that's a big one here. What are you? A big boy. <clears throat> Aha! The Red Bull type bottle. This feels similar. I shouldn't have said that I'm not mad about this because we just got to repeat within the same set again of 10. I don't know if I need 10 of them. Probably not. Just don't do this to me. Oh, the witchy brand of drink. This one's a really cute bottle. This I really like. Oh no, it's peeled. It is peeled. We shall use some Mod Podge. Very cute still. I really feel deceived because all of these are sold as different brands. So my cool... I bought 240, eight different brands, therefore I should get eight different roster pools of different things. I said innocently or maybe stupidly again. Probably stupidly. <laughs> oh no. I'm not happy about this. I don't want the same things over and over. There's a reason why I bought different ones. We have a Chavas Regal. And this one is a green bottle. Is that Sprite? Holy carp. Okay, that is cute. This is the first one of these Sprite that we get. I like this. It's a weird looking bottle, but I have to say I'm digging it. Oh, this one's tiny. Oh, vintage bottle with little speckles. And another absolute vodka. I really like this one. Again, I'm kind of okay with brands that I'm familiar with, so that's okay for me, at least anyways. At this point, another one of these. They seem to really like this one. It seems to like the same things over and over, actually. Oh, what are you? So I feel like this one, I would just replace it with Fanta because I have two of them. Or Crush or whatever is your favorite orangey drink. Another soda water. We fly in through these because at this point, we're just seeing so many of the same thing. Here is Chang Classic, which I don't think I've ever had, but I really love the shape of this bottle. It just feels so nice. It really does curve very nice. I know I'm complimenting a bottle, but it is a pretty bottle. Here is, okay, similarly to the pink one that we got that didn't have any name, this one, we have a green one, which again, that's pretty cool because they can just be decorations in the kitchen or wherever you want them. You can label them yourselves, so that's pretty cool. And this is a big bottle. Oh, let's peek in out. Oh yes, this is the soju I really like. They really get fruity flavors pretty good. Down to the last 10 of the bottles. So far, I can't believe, I can't believe eight different brands gave us the exact same pool of items. Will this be any different or will it be the most disappointing? I guess you and I will find out pretty soon. We're basically putting all our hope into this one. You know what that means? Put your hand together and pray to the mystery bag gods. Dear mystery bag gods of Evermore, please protect me from doubles, flatbacks, and false advertisement. And also, stop giving me crap. Oh, this is a stocky one, very stocky. What are you? Whoa, what is that? Orange juice? Oh, orange bonbon. Yeah, the label, not so great. Kind of like the can idea, but it has, it has work to be done. But that's a good start. Oh. Oh, so we have a bottle of Evian water. Let's not jinx it. This is new. Oh my God. We have a warthog type of drink. It's called Kaler, I think. That is really cool. This is the first time we get of that one. You are. Oh, we have another just, just beer. 
and I'm pretty sure we got this one, but I'm not mad about it. It's a very standard bottle type look and feel, so we can definitely mod this. It's a good canvas. Oh, another empty green one. It's kind of on the yellowish side, so it could be a kind of olive oil in the kitchen. And, oh no, we just got two beer in the same set of ten. The lies never stop, I say. They do not stop. Oh, a little Coca-Cola. I think this is like a Coke Zero because the label is black. Last time we got Coca-Cola, I think it was the green one. And many of you grains inform me that that's like the one sweetened with stevia or something like that. What are you? This is chonky. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my gosh. Get out! Get! There you go. Oh, interesting bottle. Aha, uh -huh, a Jack Daniels. Looks like the toy photography is going to be partying hard. <clears throat> and the last one. Oh, another blue bottle of the Harbin. I like them. I kind of like the blue bottles. I just wished it was something else. And so here is the loot of foods for decoration. They're just so pink. It's nauseating. This is not decoration for your dollhouse or figurines. And then we have the bottle collection. If you grains are interested, for sure, go with the bottle collection because these are definitely way more usable. If you're looking for cabochons, you can buy them way cheaper than the price of a mystery bag. Let me know if your prediction of opening all 240 were correct. Very curious, because it breaks my heart. If you want to see the previous 120, make sure you check up here. And if you want to see a video of just me being crafty and creating the biggest eraser ever with 88 blocks of clay make sure you check down here and yes they are Mariah Elizabeth clay until then I will see grains in the next video